born in a small town in the state of Kentucky. The town was known as Russellville. He lived in a small house with his mom and his dad. Both of them had to work just to barely keep them alive. So when Johnny was young, both of them would go to work every day, and he kind of had to learn how to take care of himself. Every day, he would go outside and play with the neighborhood kids. They would play, build forts, occasionally play in the woods. Most of the times, they would talk, play video games, and just do what young boys would do. They eventually grew old enough so they could both, they all three could go to school and have the same classes and all that crap together. When Johnny went to school, he always made sure to get a good education so this wouldn't happen. <laughs> Yeah, you get why he wanted a good education now, don't you? He grew up, and began to start, he began to grow up, and he began to think about college. So eventually, he decided he would move to Kentucky, he would move to Lexington and go to Transley for a good degree. So thus he began to travel. And travel and travel. still had his friends from when he first went to school, but his friends had made new friends. Well, they still couldn't replace Johnny, but one of them met a girl named Vanessa and thought Vanessa and Johnny were pretty good together. After a while, they talked, and eventually this is what was going through Johnny's mind. They broke up multiple times and got back together about like two times maybe. I'm not quite sure. No one really paid attention to that part. But eventually, well, the two liked each other so much that they eventually were beginning, well, Vanessa got pregnant. They had to get married immediately. So as quickly as they could, they arranged a wedding for the next month later. They got married and had a very big wedding with barely any people there, mainly just their parents. But they were meant for each other. When they got married, they moved into Venice's Venice's house. Her dad, her mom had already moved out and bought a new house, and her dad the same too. Her dad was helping them pay the mortgage. But about about mm, five months later, a baby was the baby had been born. Johnny was there. They bought, he bought, he looked at the little baby and just thought to himself, 18 years, 18 years, hmm, he smiled and walked out of the room to let Vanessa and the baby named Caitlin sleep. The baby grew up, she was playful, fun, and everything was a game to her. She always bugged her parents so they would play with her because she was, well, she never really had any friends until she went to school. She 
was always dancing, knocking them over, and just roughhousing all the generosity. It's fun. It's her way to play. And that's how it starts. Lisa and Johnny had another child. And Caitlin was there to see this young baby named Kelsey. Just like they did last time, they left the room so that the baby and the mom could get some nice sleep before they went home. To this day, the family is still happy. Caitlin and Kelsey play together. Johnny and Vanessa occasionally fight, but they always make up in the end. And so do the, t the parents also fight with the children. Kelsey not as much, because she was still a toddler. But Caitlin was in middle school, 7th grade to be exact. Kelsey, hmm, 18 months around the time. Johnny and Nisa, Caitlin and Kelsey, one happy family that will live together for on and on and on and so on and so forth.